An urn contains two red, three orange, and five blue balls. Two balls are randomly selected without replacement. What is the sample space of this experiment? What is the probability of each point in this sample space? We have two red, three oranges, and five blue balls. So basically, to get two ball out from these total of ten balls, there should be six different outcomes, which will be a red and an orange. A red and a blue, a red and a red, an orange and a blue, an orange and an orange, a blue and a blue. Notes order doesn't matter since we are drawing two balls at a time. So let's look at the probability of each of these points of the sample space. So these six different outcomes represents the six points in the sample space. Six points of this sample space. So the, for the first one, the probability equals to two over ten times three over nine. times 2. Why is that? Well, first of all, we are going to choose a red ball out of the 10 balls. So that we know will be 2 out of 10. After the first ball is chosen, we are going to select an orange ball from the remaining ball, which is 3 of the nine balls left. Well, if the order does matter, then this will be the probability of getting a red ball and then an orange ball. However, since order doesn't matter, we also need to add the case where we get an orange ball first, so which will be three over 10, and then a red ball second, which is 2 over 9. That's the answer for the first probability. So similarly, for red and then blue, it will be 2 choosing, choosing 2 from 10 balls, and then choosing 5 from 9 balls. And then since they are different balls, so there are two ways of getting this outcome, which is similar as the previous case. But to get two red balls, it will be 2 out of 10 times 1 out of 9. In this case, even if we swap the first ball and the second ball, is still considered the same outcome. So we don't actually multiply it by two. Uh, for the next case, we're gonna get an orange and a blue. So three over 10 times five over nine. Orange, well, times two. Orange, orange, that'll be three over 10 times two over nine. Finally, blue and blue. 5 over 10, 4 over 9. So the answer would be 12 over 90, 20 over 90, 2 over 90, 30 over 90, 6 over 90, 20 over 90. And then to confirm, we can sum up all these probabilities 
So if you look at 12 plus 2 plus 6, that's 20, plus 20, that's 40, plus 30, that's 70, plus 20, that's 90. So it, they do add up to 1, which should be always the case for the sum of all the probability of each point in the sample space. So there you go, that's the answer.